Hi, I'm Paddy Taylor from MRMC and I'm here on our stand in Hall 11 at IBC 2022. Uh, we've got a lot going on, we've got some uh, big robotics, uh, we've got a QRS rail system running over there, underslung from the truss with a UE150 Panasonic PCZ camera. It's a really simple cost effective rail system, uh, compatible with, with pretty much any PCZ camera. Um, Bird Dog, Lumens, Panasonic, Sony, Canon, you know, it's totally open to us. Um, we also have our own ruggedized ARC360 PTZ camera. So this is an outdoor uh, PTZ camera. It's designed for permanent installations, concerts, music uh, venues, festivals, uh, often installed in stadiums, sports. They've been put on top of masts on ships. Um, you know, a really uh, well-built, well-constructed product with an integrated wiper. It's also got roll functionality. So if you're mounting it somewhere and there's a chance that there's going to be sway or there may not be level, you're able to use the roll function to level the image of it, which makes it really unique. Um, and that's started shipping in July, so we're very excited to have it here at the show, being shown as part of our sports systems, but also in manual control. Um, as well as the straight QRS rail we've got um, over my shoulder here, uh, just put that down. We've got um, our new curved rail system. So that's uh, something that we've been working on with a new partner called Slide Camera, which I'll talk about uh, a bit later on. Um, but we have lots of customers that are interested in the QRS but are asking the question, what do we do if we have curved rail systems? The problem with curved rail is everyone wants a different bend. Um, so what we're doing now is we're building two different arc radius circles and holding them in stock. So if a customer just wants curved rail, there'll be versions available in stock by MRMC from our, our reseller partners. But also if you need a specific bend radius, a specific arc radius to a bend, we can absolutely do that. Just contact us and we can advise pricing and lead times for that. The other thing we have here is Polymotion Chat. So um, this is our award-winning automated talent tracking software. There's two levels, Polymotion Chat Pro and Polymotion Chat Studio. Polymotion Chat Pro is software only. So you install it on your own computer, it needs to be a high-spec machine, minimum i7 with an NVIDIA GTX 1080 graphics card or better. It must have the CUDA chip to work with the system. And essentially it uses machine vision processing and limb detection to follow the talent. So you can see in the image here, we've got dots and a, and a stick figure overlay that's being generated. By using limb detection, it makes it much more reliable than face detection systems. So there's quite a few automated tracking PTZs and automated tracking software on the market. Those will use facial recognition one of the issues there is if somebody is obscured behind a wall or if they turn round or there are multiple people in the shot, those systems can struggle. By using the biomechanics of the limb detection, we're able to create a unique identifier and be far more reliable than just the face tracking. The other big advantage it gives us is by measuring the biomechanics, we're able to predict movement. So for example, if the person's right shoulder is above their left and the right hip's above their left, they're going to move left. And that gives us the ability to start moving the head before the subject starts to move, which means we don't have that robotic sort of movement that you get with some of the automated systems. Polymotion Chat really operates like a natural human camera operator would. The Polymotion Chat Pro version uh, is available uh, with a single camera license or two or up to three cameras. You can buy it as a bundle uh, to begin with. And again, it is totally agnostic in terms of cameras. If the camera supports Visca over IP or NDI, we can support it. We also support a number of cameras using their native web API. Um, so that includes Panasonic, it includes Canon, Bird Dog, JVC, Sony, Lumens. Pretty much all the PTZ cameras that are on the market will work. And again, that's true with the, um, the rail and other systems. The Polymotion Chat Studio version will give you the ability to control up to 10 cameras, but you can also daisy chain uh, systems together if you need to control more heads. So it's a very popular system for reality TV uh, projects or observational documentaries. So our big news for the uh, IBC is we've acquired a company called Slide Camera. Um, if you don't know who Slide Camera are, they're a European manufacturer of a bunch of robotic uh, motion control products. Actually, they're a competitor to MRNC in some areas, but 
We've been working with them on a number of joint products, and we liked the rest of their range so much we decided to purchase them. Um, so they brought in a whole range of, of new systems. We have um, some lower cost pan tilt heads, but an underslung unit above me, the X head. We've got the bull head running on a curved rail over in the corner here. I've got a bull head studio running behind me on the Titan slider. So what we're going to be having is um, their products in terms of robotic heads will be branded MRMC or slide camera by MRMC. And the difference will be the ecosystem, the software control. So all the slide camera products will work within Polymotion Chat. If you want to use the rail or the slider or any of their heads, you'll be able to do that. But you'll purchase the MRMC versions of those products. If you're interested in slide camera or you already have slide camera products, you would purchase the slide camera by MRMC versions and they would be configured to run with their software. If for any reason you wanted to move from one ecosystem to the other, that's fine. It is just the firmware running on the head. Um, so we provide a download utility that you can do to update the head and switch from one version to the other. They also have a bunch of manual products. So they have um, sliders, jibs, um, a whole range of other rail systems. Again, they are all going to be continued and they will be branded and sold as slide camera by MRMC. We're really excited by what this brings us. One of the things that we've been looking at is to try and get some lower cost heads to market. But when we've been looking at third party products or developing new things, trying to find a way of getting the high quality that we expect at MRMC into more cost effective package has been a real challenge. By working with Slide Camera on the joint products, we realized that their designs and the way they produce their products was, was of an extremely high standard. And we are really pleased to be able to put the MRMC name to those products because we believe in them. The guys that created these products created them because they were looking for filmmaking tools for themselves. That's where they come from. They're engineers that are making their own productions that were looking for the tools that would give them the ability to do that. So the products are born out of passion. They're really well designed in terms of simplicity, in terms of mounting, connecting, configuring. You can take a section of rail and set it up in 10 or 15 minutes and then add another section of rail in, in two or three minutes. It's that simple. And by adding it to the MRMC family, we're able to bring our encoding technology, providing 3D data out to give positional information to integ integrate these products, particularly the rails, into virtual graphics systems. So there's a lot coming from this. There's going to be a lot coming again in the near future, but it's great to have them as part of the MRMC family.